All right, folks, enough. I've talked to some of you about a little portable power rig that I've uh, been working on. Uh, it's combined with a 40 watt solar panel. And what I did, I took a standard size battery box and put a uh, sealed, uh, what's called an, uh, an AGM battery. Uh, which is an acid glass uh, plate uh, battery and which can be sealed and even can be put inside of a tent when you go camping or it can be also used uh, you know inside of a house or a garage you don't have to worry about uh, vapors and fumes and stuff it's a pretty safe battery um, what I did I uh, took a, a blank box and I installed on the front of it, you can, I'll zoom in a little bit for you, a uh, little gauge and a switch so I can see the status of my battery at any time. You know, with that, uh, you, can, you don't want to run a battery too, too low, uh, though these are deep cell batteries and can be recharged many, many times. Um, on the top of it, I have a inverter that inverts from DC to AC so I can plug in uh, several outlets for that and on the side I have a um, let me zoom the proper way I have a little plug for a uh, DC accessories so if you have DC camping accessories you put them in right here on that side and then of course uh, this here I also put a light on uh, this thing so that it has a light uh, up on my uh, handle so that if you, you know, need some extra light in your room or if you have a power failure or if you're camping for a campsite you can also have your light that you can use on that. Uh, that light is a DC light pulling uh, directly off the solar inverter. I have all control, a sort of solar controller that I have built into this. Uh, this is my cabling right here for the solar panel. I have enough to extend the panel about 15 feet away from the system. The um, handle is also removable on here. I have uh, just some bolts put through uh, the handle so that uh, you can just uh, unscrew the bolt with a little just a quick release and I have a on the side a connector um, which you can quick connect and disconnect the um, light you can also if you want on a connector you can uh, run lighting like 12 volt lighting in your garage or shed and you can connect it right to that connector so you could use it for a variety of things also you can um, I'll put wheels on this little box uh, the uh, extensions that you see are PVC that I uh, painted black I didn't paint the handle just so that you can see the contrast in the two um, pretty much that's about it it's got a solar controller on the inside and then I have the uh, inverter to convert from AC to DC and then the 12 volt accessory uh, socket on the other side so it is um, transportable, it's movable um, you can like I said remove the handle and disconnect the back and this is also portable now these things here are for when if you want to move the whole thing as one piece you can simply just take these extensions that I have which actually are the supports for my solar panel when it's standing up and I have some bungee cords that you can put them at different levels you can actually just slide this right into here and then with my bungee cords And actually just hook it right up. I'm just going to do it very quick here just to give you an example. And then you can transport the whole thing. So the whole thing can be rolled. And you can also just use it like this if you want. Where you can change your angles by adjusting your straps. 
I have two of them, but I just did a quick one just to show you what it was like. You know, but they uh, are made to be set properly. But that's it. That's my portable backup uh, generated power. And uh, if you have any questions, anybody wants to know anything about it, just uh, feel free to let me know. I'll give you any information you want. Other than that, take it easy and thanks for watching. Bye.